Today, I have a couple errands to do. Um, right now, I'm just getting up. That's something. Best thing about break is sleeping in, I tell you. But what I'm about to do is I'm about to wash my face, um, put on some clothes, put on a shirt. Um, I got to go to UPS, and then I got to head over to um, Plato's Closet. Because, for well, one, I just ripped my last good pair of pants, ripped it in the thigh. Um, so I need some jeans to wear to work. Um, and I need some other clothes, like some shirts. I don't really, and I need a pair of black pants. Um, so I need to go get me some things just to hold me right now. Because what I'm trying to do tomorrow is I'm going to go through all my clothes and start taking that to Goodwill. Because I have a lot of stuff that I brought from school and I don't even wear it. So there's no point in me keeping it. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm about to do. And after that, I'm going to UPS. And then I got to clean my house. Like, it's just so much I got to do today. But, you know, and I got a couple videos I want to record. So I'm sitting here debating if I'm about to beat my face. I really don't feel like it. I feel like this vlog needs to be as real as possible. Well, my channel needs to be as real as possible. Um, because I think that makes great YouTube. So y'all should like me ugly and all. So, but yeah, I am currently getting dressed and things like that. And then we will talk more when I get in the car. Okay. I got my coffee. I got me a white chocolate mocha latte with soy milk. Oh, that's good. Y'all, excuse my shirt. I don't know what's like. It's like, you know, like when you wash your black shirt with something and get all linty. But yeah, mine is all linty and I look a hot mess, but I really don't give a crap. All right, now we're going to um, head over to Play-Doh's Closet. And then there's something called another uh, store. But the problem with these stores is, it's like they usually don't have my size or things that look cute in my size. So I'm hoping, you know, I get some good stuff today. I need a pair of black pants, a pair of jeans, and a couple of long sleeves, like two or three. Even four long sleeve shirts, because that's a week of shirts that I could switch out. And then eventually I'm going to need to go get some new shoes because my... My little loafers is, they need to go. Um, so give me some comfortable work shoes. So that's what we're trying to do. I'm not trying to spend too much money because I don't got that kind of money. But I do want to get me something cute. So let me drive and I'll be back. All right, y'all. So I am home finally. Um, I just picked up my package from the office. But I wanted to quickly, you know, show you guys my makeup that I bought from Juvia's Place. And show you the clothes that I have. I got y'all on my iPhone, so I wanted to try to vlog using my iPhone today. Um, I got the XS Max. And honestly, this thing is lit. Like, I've really been enjoying it. It's clear quality, things like that. All right. So let's look at, first we'll do my clothes. Like I said, I spent like $52. So I got these jeans. These are 18. Let's see my receipt. I thought these was cute, something quick, and they're kind of stretchy. I don't like jeans that, I, I, I'm sure my thick girls who ever watch this will agree, but I don't like jeans that are like really stiff in the waist. And I like to pull my pants up here, you know, to cover my belly. And I don't want jeans that are, you know what I mean? Like too baggy or like too tight, cause that hurts my stomach. So I got a belly, so I need something that's stretchy. I got this pink jacket, y'all. This right here, boy. Oh my God, I gotta take this back. She didn't take these off. Oh, I gotta go back. Why wouldn't you take this off? I gotta go all the way back to Plato's closet. I'm gonna eat my food first. This is ridiculous. I think she did. I hope that's the only one. Okay, yeah, that's it. I got a pair of leggings. These are extra large, so we gonna see if they fit on my butt like I need them. Oh, these were only $10. I need a pair of leggings, so I told y'all it is time to get right and lose the weight I wanna lose. Do you have these little zippers on them? I don't know what the heck these zippers are for. But yeah, some leggings. Oh, I'm mad about that jacket. I got it all the way back. I got this dry fit shirt because I really needed one to work out in. 
and it has like a it has like a bra on the inside but i have big boobs so we'll see if this works this is a uh, extra large i think or 2x it's a 2x Man. I got a neon dry fit shirt. I've always seen people in one of these and I was like, oh my God, I want one. I just didn't want to spend the money. So I went ahead and just bought it. I got this for like $5, which I'm pretty excited about. So I thought this would be cute to work out in. And then last, I got these like spandex. I guess these are like running pants, performance pants. These are extra large. They are a crew, a crux. I don't know. But I thought these was cute. I thought these would be good to work out in. So yeah, I got some name brand stuff. I'm mad about my jacket. That means I gotta drive all the way back over there. It's 20 minutes of my life that I have to spend. So honestly, I might be going tomorrow because I don't feel like it today. All right, next, I finally got my makeup from Juvia's Place. So I ordered this prior to Christmas. Um, I thought it was gonna be here because one of these pouches, I got like two of these pouches for somebody else and then I got some for me. Oh no. I hate these packing peanuts, bro, what? Huh. We don't want this shit. Hold on. You know what? I'm just not gonna even. Okay, but where's the. This is that shit. What the hell? I'm sorry, y'all. Hold on. I'm a... These shits are annoying. I got to make sure I don't leave none on the ground because my dog will eat it and die. I just don't understand why this is... I mean, I get it because I've been mad my palettes were broken, but dang. Oh, let me tell y'all what happened at UPS. I'm at UPS thinking, you know, I didn't print... I'm shipping back some shoes, returning some shoes for my roommate. And, um... I thought, I, you know, you could print at UPS. So I didn't print it before I left. And so I guess that was my mistake because the girl was like, do you have the code for Amazon? And I was like, no, I don't have no code. What you talking about, bro? And so then it makes, all in all, I wasted my time going to UPS because the girl ain't had what I, I still had to come all the way home and do what I had to do. Shit is crazy. I was pissed. So I came home, had to come back home, print everything, and then finally took it to another UPS that was close to my house and went. All right, so I got four palettes. Um, palettes. I'm probably gonna give two to my sister and then one to my roommate, depending on which one I want. But I got the Sahara, the Sa, the Saharan, the Nubian, the Warrior and the masquerade i'm pretty sure i'm gonna keep the warrior i like gold tones i don't really like all the bright stuff um we can open it and see what it looks like that's just me i like gold and stuff like that i don't like like i'm not about to wear no green eyeshadow you know what i mean i'll probably wear like a golden or a brown let's see let's open this up oh this is gorgeous hmm this is gorgeous. My next buy is gonna be crayon case. I just didn't do it this Christmas because them suckers were sold out. Yo, super sick. Sponsor me, sis. Like, come on. I will support I support black businesses, especially black women, super. You know, holla at me. Watch my blogs. You know what I mean? I'm a teacher. I'm on the come up, trying to get my life right. Trying to be like you, sis. Make it by my mama at house. So just let me know when. I'll be one of your fat girl models, you know what I mean? See my mouth poses, you know what I mean? Come on, I can't do makeup like that, but sis, we can learn, come on. This is the warrior. I'm gonna go ahead and open that bad boy.
Oh yeah, this smell must be. I like like browns and stuff. I like this. This one's probably gonna be mine. If not, probably this is mine. I love these colors. I like these kind of, I'm like a natural tone kind of girl. I don't like nothing too extravagant. And these are something that I would wear. I like a little sparkle, stuff like that. So I'm probably keeping this one for myself. The big one will go to my roommate because I got her one. And then these two other ones are gonna go to my sister. Cause you know, I spoiled my sister. I try to. I like her a little bit. <sighs> this right here is the Nubian. Oh, this is pretty. smaller ones for my sister because first of all she don't wear make eyeshadow like that but i knew like she would appreciate this kind of stuff when she starts to wear it. i'm gonna be pissed if she doesn't because i'm gonna just tell her to get the back to me because i will figure out a way i wear i try to wear eyeshadow every day to work just to like give me a little pop i don't highlight no more because like i'm not i'm not beating this face for my kids you know what i mean i just do it so i don't look like i'm rising from the dead because I, I really do rise from the dead especially when it's a rough day and i don't want to be there just almost every day and then this last one's the saharan oh yeah these are cute But yeah, I got these. I'm excited. They finally came. It took forever. Um, but that's only holiday. I, I read that only during the holidays is that bad. Because I got this when it had the 50% off sale. So if you are interested in Juvia's Place, maybe I'll do one day a little photo shoot on my Instagram. So I can show y'all how I be. Or get ready with me. I'm not that specialized in makeup, but I can try. What's good, you two? I'm back with another video. I am in my car. Um, it's another one of my amazing blazing vlogs. Uh, today I am rocking my Ivy Park. You know what I'm saying? So Beyonce, if you wanna sponsor me, you know, just let me know. And I got another sweatshirt. It's kind of hot, and I wasn't expecting it to be kind of warm. Um, hey friends, we are at Barnes and Noble. Wanna look for some books? Saying it's a test, we be just so we know it. 365, you only want to try. It's not like you can get enough. Hey guys, so I'm about to leave. Barnes Noble went on my roommate. Um, I got two Roxanne Gray, Roxanne Gay books because that's my girl. Um, I actually did my thesis using one of her books, and then I got like a mindfulness calendar. But yeah, now we're gonna go look at shoes because I need some sneakers and some work shoes, so I'm gonna go look for some. Then we're gonna go to Walmart. Then I'm ready to go home so I can read my books and do nothing. Okay, we're back. Okay guys, so the shoe place was a dump. Um, I just didn't see nothing that like spoke out to me. I might try shoe carnival tomorrow. But now we're going to Walmart to grocery shop and then I guess we'll see what happens after that. I yeah it was a it wasn't a bad shop this is a pretty good one um i also want to show y'all the books that i got so i'm trying to have you know everybody goes to, to through a new year and they're trying to be mindful but since i'm 22 trying to go on 23 i want my early 20s to not be a bunch of mess ups but more like a bunch of growth so that I have room to mess up later, if that makes sense. Like, I don't want to fall on my face now. Because it's just like, I want to retire at 40 and travel the world. I want to be a millionaire by 35, you know? Or at least not a millionaire, but at least comfortable, you know? So that's where I'm at. So I want to have that mindset while I'm young and can do it. It can 
I guess, make a mistake in that mindset and bring it back, you know? But instead of falling on my face and completely just losing it. So, I'm trying to be mindful of that. So, I got me some books. I got... I love her. If you have not read Bad Feminist, um, then you need to get your life together. That one right there, that Bad Feminist, actually, like, I used it for my thesis um, in college. And it actually, like, spoke to me so much about my identity. Like, it was me and her were just speaking the same truths, I tell you. Um, I got Hunger by her, which is I'm excited about. And that's Roxanne. And then this is what I got. Mindful jour journaling, rewrite the script of your life. And I guess it's like a daily like journal um, for you to do to kind of help you be more mindful of yourself, help you figure out your truths and your passions. And I kind of felt like this would be good for me going into New Year because I, like I said, I do have a lot of Yo, DJ Murray, go in. Okay, okay, okay. So we saw Aquaman. What would you rate it? 10 being the greatest. I give Aquaman an 8. Okay. I give it a 7. I think some of the storyline. It was good. Needed but work. There was, it was good. Aquaman wasn't the issue. It was a couple of the characters. Yeah. And a couple of the um, effects were kind of corny in a sense. I, I thought the effects but, were good. But DC, but DC, I all, the effects were good, but DC has a specific style. And I think I'm, a just, yeah. I'm just a Marvel girl. Because DC Comics always look like that. They have like but a see, grunge that looks, look. That looks more Marvel recently because DC is normally very dark. And well, that was it, actually it pretty had the dark elements. So that's the action. ones I didn't like. But see, DC doesn't have a lot of action either. That yeah. was a lot of action. Yeah. So you can tell that was like some I give it a seven and a half. I give it a seven and a half with that. But some of the writing was trash. Some of the jokes were, they were funny that they tried to get him to do. And I'm not going to spoil this for y'all. But some of the stuff was funny. Some of it was like... I think, okay, him as Aquaman, perfect. Him as Aquaman, perfect. Oh, uh, I thought you were about to tell a spoiler. You can't uh, tell the people a spoiler. Him as Aqu Jason Momoa did the damn thing. Yeah, that was Jason a great Momoa casting. as Aquaman was perfect. Too. Some of them other ones? And his storyline, his background was perfect. His back And the his fact that they had his perfect. dad brown and his mom white instead of this doing two white parents. Be. Because that would have been weird. But his, but his brother was two white people, so... It's cool. No, but they made the they made the heritage the the you know what I mean his heritage yeah, correct. Yeah, his heritage is correct. Because most times in these kind of movies, they don't do that. But yeah, that's the only spoiler y'all gonna get from me. Um, but other than that, Aquaman was good. We are on our way home. I'll have to get back with y'all tomorrow when I go to the eye doctor. Big, 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 big. I can't even pass.